The new Volvo V40 was officially introduced at the Geneva Motor Show in March and will arrive to the streets at the end of the summer. Despite its V designation, the V40 is not your typical station wagon. It's a five-door hatchback. The V40 is also the first car in the world that includes an airbag for pedestrians as a standard feature. In collisions at speeds between 20 and 50 km per hour, the speed range of most urban accidents, this new airbag will automatically inflate to help protect passersby. As you can see from the headlamps, the roofline, and the rear lights, this new 4.37 meter Volvo is a mix of the S60 and the XC60, still maintaining the company's signature boxy style. Volvo fans will also recognize the rear design as reminiscent of the legendary P1800. With a cargo capacity between 335 and 1,032 liters, the trunk is not like a station wagon's. On sale in September, five engines will be offered initially, two gasoline engines and three diesel. These engines will range in horsepower from 115 to 180. Each vehicle will come standard with automatic start-stop and a braking energy recovery system. The most fuel-efficient diesel engine consumes 3.6 liters of fuel per 100 kilometers and emits only 94 grams of CO2 per kilometer. The most powerful engine, a 254 horsepower turbo, will arrive at the end of the year. The V40 diesel with 115 horsepower will cost around 25,000 euros or $30,000. The gasoline version with 150 horsepower will be 300 euros cheaper. Later this year, Volvo will introduce the XC40, a cross-country version with four-wheel drive. As with the V40, the pedestrian airbag will come standard. <laughs> 